Hello, it's Pastor Keith, and it's morning prayer for Monday, April 29th, 2024. And the psalm for this morning is Psalm 80, a prayer for restoration. Give ear, O shepherd of Israel, you who lead Joseph like a flock, you who are enthroned upon the cherubim, shine forth before Ephraim and Benjamin and Manasseh. Stir up your might and come to save us. Restore us, O God. Let your face shine that we may be saved. O Lord God of hosts, how long will you be angry with your people's prayers? You have fed them with the bread of tears and given them tears to drink in full measure. You make us the scorn of our neighbors. Our enemies laugh among us. Restore us, O God of hosts. Let your face shine that we may be saved. You brought a vine out of Egypt. You drove out the nations and planted it. You cleared the ground for it. It took deep root and filled the land. The mountains were covered with its shade, the mighty cedars with its branches. It sent out its branches to the sea and its shoots to the river. Why then have you broken down its walls so that all who pass along the way pluck its fruit? The boar from the forest ravages it. All that move in the field feed on it. Turn again, O God of hosts. Look down from heaven and see. Have regard for this vine, the stalk that your right hand planted. They have burned it with fire. They have cut it down. May they perish at the rebuke of your countenance. But let your hand be upon the one at your right hand, and the one whom you made strong for yourself. Then we will never turn back from you. Give us life, and we will call on your name. Restore us, O Lord God of hosts. Let your face shine, that we may be saved. Probably picked that for today because of the vine imagery, and uh, that was part of the gospel reading from John 15 yesterday, uh, Sunday, in, uh, in the morning reading. And uh, again, uh, this vine is in trouble in this uh, passage, and uh, is uh, probably representative of Israel and can be representative of us if we are down, right? And seeking restoration. E pule kako. Let us pray. O God, you gave us your Son as the vine apart from whom we cannot live. Nourish our life in his resurrection, that we may bear the fruit of love and know the fullness of your joy. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And now may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord's face shine on you with grace and mercy. The Lord look upon you with favor and grant you peace throughout this day. Amen.